Daddy is going to be so pleased when he finds out we're holding a croquet tournament. Especially today, the anniversary of his legendary perfect game. Legendary? And yet, have you ever heard of it? No, but I'm not much of a sports fan. Too much competition. Play through, Tarzan. Slim? Is that all right? Oh, not bad. <laughs> For a beginner. Oh, oh, watch me. Huh? Oh. Tantor, your technique is all wrong. sun was in my eyes? Well, it would appear that we need more coconuts. I'll round some up. Now remember, not a word to Daddy. This is a surprise. Uh, I'm not entirely comfortable with surprises. They uh, tend to sneak up on you. <laughs> <sighs> I can't wait to see the look on Daddy's face. Oh, he will be so... <gasps> oh, you, you poor thing. Now, don't be afraid, little one. I, I just want to help. There, there. It's all right. Now, let's find out what the problem is, shall we? Be gone, beast! I am done with you. From Opa. Oh. Oh. You weak, useless creature. You'll never make the journey to Opa by yourself. But with Tarzan's help, hmm, that's a different story. What's the deal? It's almost time to tee off. Jane's not back yet. Well, can't we start without her? Not unless you know the rules. Oh, we can make them up as we go, huh? <gasps> Perfect! Okay, first one to break a ball gets a hundred points. <laughs> go! Ah, Tarzan, Turk Tantor, what are we all up to today? Uh, nothing. Oh, nothing at all. Not a thing. Splendid. What's in the bag? Bag? <laughs> what bag? Oh, uh, you mean this bag? It's a... Uh... Uh, well, these are, uh, nothing important. Righto! So where's Jade? We were just wondering the same thing. <gasps> Tarzan, darling! Jane, I was starting to worry. Oh, how charming! Say, let's you and I go on a little outing. Just the two of us. Hmm? Uh, I don't understand. I thought I was being crystal clear. You mean jungle picnic? But, Jane, it's, it's, it's time for the, uh, the... Thing? What are you talking about? What thing? You know, the croquet tournament. I've no time for games, Tarzan. Games, did you say? Uh, am I missing something? <laughs> Not a thing. Ridiculous buffoon. Come, Tarzan, we're going. <laughs> Why are you acting like this? Oh, Tarzan, you silly. I'm only teasing. Now come with me, please. Jane? Something is wrong. It certainly is. You don't care a whit about my feelings. Jane, wait. No, Tarzan. You stay. Play with your little friends. Stubborn man. Leaving me to make my way through the wilderness in this flimsy body. What have we here? Ah, Jane. As always, I am quite delighted to see you. And are you? You are? Why, of course, mister. Dumont, you look like a man who knows how to handle the jungle. Oh, why, Jane, I thought you hadn't noticed. Oh, but I have. <laughs> Say, would you mind doing me a tiny favor? For you? Anything. 
Now, what do you suppose that's all about? Ooh, I'd hate to conjecture, but it doesn't look good for our buddy Tarzan. Poor fella, you think we should tell him? Are you kidding? I've seen Tarzan get mad. When he finds out, he's likely to go, well, ape. Good point. Mum's the word. Yeah, zip it up. Oh, you are so kind, Monsieur Dumont. Uh, it is an honor, madame. But I must ask, uh, why isn't Tarzan escorting you? He's busy. But I'm just happy to have a big, strong man like you to make sure I'm safe. Ah, stay behind me, Jane. One never knows what dangers lurk out here in the jungle. Yes, one never knows. When I looked into Jane's eyes, I... I saw a different person. Ah, you're imagining it. Come on, join a game! Yeah, this croquet game is fun. Did someone mention croquet? Not me! Crow who? Never heard of it. You know, I was quite the croquet player in my time. Uh, say, have I ever told you the tale of my perfect game? Brace yourself. Boring story at 3 o'clock. Something is wrong. I must find Jane. Oh, well, he will, will come too! Right behind you! It was a glorious day on the lawn. My arch rival Philander had jumped out to an early lead. But that day, <sighs> oh, man, it could do no wrong. Jane? Hugo, hoofed. Have you seen Jane? <laughs> well, Tarzan, I didn't see you there. Uh, but, but no, no, I haven't seen Jane. Uh, have you, Hugo? Uh, no, sir. And, and I didn't see her go off on a picnic with Dumont, either. Oh. <laughs> Which way did they go? Hang on, Jane. Here we go. <sighs> oh, well, thank you, Mr. Demont. I simply don't know what I'd do without you. Not at all. Well, this must be a very special place we are going. You have no idea. Jane! Uh, did you hear something? No, keep moving. We're almost there. Uh, shall we? almost took a nasty tumble. Yes, quite nasty indeed. A word of advice, my young friend. One should sit on rocks, not under them. I was following, uh, Jane. Jane did this to me. You'll find that your Jane was not your Jane. Rest, my friend. All will be explained soon. Oh, we have arrived! We have? Oh, isn't it glorious? I suppose, in an overgrown, ruined sort of way. This was Opar, the lost city, the realm of Queen La. Ah, <laughs> yes. Uh, Jane, sit. Uh, it's been a long journey. Please, I brought some very nice sandwiches. Dig. Pardon me? Dig! Oh, uh, uh, yes. Uh, what exactly am I looking for? Something very special. Uh, uh. Oh, ah. It smells bad, but heals well. I've seen you before. You're a Waziri elder. I prefer to think of myself as experienced. I am Usula. What are you doing so far from home? Ugh. I have been pursuing an ancient spirit named La. Queen La? She's dead. No, La's body may be dust, but her spirit still Ugh. lives. You speak in riddles. Ugh. It makes me sound wise. I fear that the spirit of Queen La has possessed your Jane. 
When I looked into her eyes, I knew something was wrong. Yes! Give it to me! It's quite lovely, Jane. Now, let's commence our little repast. Not until we find the other half. Speak to me, my staff! Announce your presence! Madame, you need help. I shall find Tarzan at once and tell him where you are. Uh, goodbye, Jane. You dare turn your back on Queen La! <gasps> there it is. That is a considerable improvement. Now kneel before your queen. Queen La, queen of Opa. <laughs> yes, it is a tad run down, isn't it? But nothing that can't be fixed. Rise, my Opa. Our spirit can move between two creatures in contact. This is how she took your wife. How do you know so much about Queen La? La was once a Waziri. Long, long ago, La used forbidden magic to immortalize her spirit. Since that time, the Waziri have battled La. With her magic staff broken, her leopard men released, and Opa in ruins, La is weak. We can defeat La now. And save Jane. If only it were that easy, my friend. We must get to Opa before La regains her powers. Too late. A difficult task has just grown more difficult. We still have a chance. La thinks I'm dead. Ah, then the element of surprise is ours. You see, some magic here, a spell or two there, and Opa is once again the jungle's hidden treasure. Of course, there is the matter of pest control. Jane, how do we stop? No! Uh, who dares? Tarzan, you know not what you have done. I won't let you kill Jane. Jane, it's me! <laughs> Ursula, didn't you tell him? Jane is gone, Tarzan. Gone forever! All there is now is love! Hardly seems like a fair fight, does it? Yes, I prefer it that way. say there are times when a man must stand his ground and fight. This is not one of those times. Must I state the up? 
obvious. Go! And don't come back until Tarzan is dead. Statue. What do we do now? You tell me. I had but one good plan. Your plan would have killed Jane. Now we'll never release her. Tarzan, Jane is as good as dead. The best we can do is make sure La's villainy ends here. No. If someone must die to stop La, let it be me. Tarzan always makes things far more difficult than need be. But he can't hide forever. Once I give the statue warriors an order, they are relentless. Sooner or later, they'll find him. They can stop looking. Tarzan, you've come to me. Why, thank you. That saves me so much trouble. I won't let you have Jane. But I already have her, my dear. Now, would you rather be a gibbon or a jackal? Very well. I'll surprise you. Stop! What are you doing? Jumping. But, but, you'll kill us both! Jane is my only reason for living. Amazing. Such strength. Such agility. I should have taken Tarzan in the first place. I'm sorry it had to be like this, my friend. <laughs> now I see the plan. Tarzan wanted me to take his body. It might have worked. Were I still in Jane's pathetic body? But Tarzan's senses are so honed. I'm completely aware of my surroundings. And now, the final tragic twist. I finish Tarzan's one true love with his own hands. Sorry, I'm not fond of tragedy. Ah, a chase. Charming. Forever, Jane. <laughs> You'll forgive me if I keep trying. Lost! Nowhere to run, Jane. You're trapped. Just like a rat. What? No! Stop! Put me down! I'm not Tarzan! I'm. You are going nowhere. Trapped like a rat indeed. And you say this Queen La turned me into a monkey? A gibbon, actually. <laughs> Madame, the only way you could make a monkey out of me is by getting me to believe such an outlandish story. 
<laughs> Lars' magics are dangerous, unpredictable forces. But excellent croquet mallets. <laughs> good show, Sula, good show. <laughs> well done. It's nearly time for some Hakuna Matata with those grub grabbers Timon and Pumbaa, next on Disney Cinemagic. They just love bugs!